What we've got for, for you for the next few minutes is the answers to three of the most pressing questions we're hearing right now. First one, are there jobs now and how can I find them? Let, it, let me share now with you some of the key resources to help you really have a look at what the London employment landscape is looking like. So for instance, uh, LEDC uh, has a number of different uh, very useful resources. London Tech Jobs, London Manufacturing Jobs. If you go onto those websites at the bottom, you'll find a very nice spreadsheet which lists companies and openings. A concierge that's here, you will be able to find all sorts of services about uh, the employment agencies in town, various different job boards. And then when you're doing some company research, which I'm gonna be talking about more later on, our business directory, which has a mapping function, allows you to actually look at what companies are here in London in five key sectors and where are, the lo where are, they, lo where are they located? How many employees do they have? What kind of sector are they in? Really useful for you to start doing some of that company research. But I want to highlight a few uh, uh, resources. You will see the, I, we're mentioning here the Federal Job Bank. That's where very soon the federal government will be making sure that all of the summer jobs that they're funding under the Canada Summer Jobs Program will be posted. So great opportunities for you to see what companies, uh, both private sector companies under 50 employees and the not-for-profit sector uh, will be posting jobs there. Locally, Night Hunter uh, is very popular with area employers. The Charity Village is a, is a free go-to spot for the charitable and not-for-profit sector to promote jobs. You'll note, note your own uh, King's Job Board. And then two which I find really helpful. Workforce Development Map also shows hiring employers through the London Economic Region. So that includes not only London, but St. Thomas, Woodstock, Ingersoll, et cetera, and then the job board itself. When I look at it, uh, and by the way, it aggregates from a variety of different job boards, including Indeed, and also actually London Tech Jobs, London Manufacturing Jobs, Night Hunter, and others. When I looked at it today, there were over 3,500 jobs posted and many being posted every day, even though we're living in these difficult times. So yes, there are jobs open, and there are going to be even more, as I know that both the federal and the provincial government are looking at how can they support student and recent graduate employment in the weeks and months ahead. 